The Spire 4 is the flagship neutral running shoe from 361. They have a new EVA midsole material called Quick Spring Plus that allows the shoe to give more cushioning and responsiveness next to the quick foam layer that already delivers a high level of comfort. The guys at 361 have worked together with Ortholite to create their own insole material mix, resulting in a higher level of breathability and better moisture management directly under the foot. The shoe comes with a redeveloped upper with more breathability and flexibility through improved mesh materials. They've also reconstructed the heel collar to create a perfect fit and hold. The shoe weighs in at 232 grams and comes with a 9mm drop. What's up guys and welcome back to 40 Runs. Now if you're new around here don't forget to subscribe to the channel before you leave me today and check out the description there's loads of cool things down there. Right so the 361 Spire 4. Let's get stuck in. Right guys so 361. Now first up a disclaimer I was sent these shoes by 361. I was sent these and I was sent another pair and we'll do a review on them next week. But I was sent these shoes by uh, 361. They've got no control over this video. I'm not getting paid for this video. Um, they you know, say so they will see this video after you guys. So yes, I just wanted to put that out there. They did send me this shoe to test, and as you can see, I've been testing it. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to let you know before we get uh, get into it, really. So 361, firstly, who are they? Some people have heard of them, some people haven't. Uh, it's one of China's biggest uh, sports brands. Um, they make a hell of a lot of shoes out there. Uh, they're having a push into the US. They're quite successful over there. And they're making waves over here in Europe, uh, in UK and Europe. Uh, they've got some ex uh, Brooks people on board, so you know, really good guys. Uh, and they're taking that sort of ethos from Brooks and they're putting it into 361. And I think it's awesome. Um, the shoes itself, or the shoe itself, this one is the Spire 4. It's the sort of flagship neutral running shoe. It's the it's the shoe that you would probably put your most distance into. It's it's not a high tempo paced shoe or anything like that. It's I think a good comparison to like a, a Nimbus 22 from Asics. That sort of uh, is is where it's at, um, or like a maybe like a Glycerine from Brooks, something like that. It's like that more of a cushioned every day probably not but more like of a distance shoe i think that's probably where they're positioning it it's, it's the one that will eat up your miles but doing it in a comfortable way you can push on in them um you've got this quick foam uh, midsole so you know you can kick on with them it's, it's not a slow shoe it's not a heavy shoe it's very light in fact um it's a really nice place to be in here around the hill there's not too much real estate but there's just enough the lacing's great no problems there. You've got the this upper, which is really breathable. You see all the perforations in it. It's very breathable. Uh, I think personally, I think they look great. I don't know if you can see that on the camera, whether it's coming out with the spire on the pack, but I just think they look awesome. Love the colorway. Uh, they do come in some other colors, but I really dig this one. But yeah, I think the whole thing as a package is, is quite interesting. And I've put some miles on them um, over the last few weeks. Uh, you know, I took them out on a 16 miler done a few um, sort of faster sessions in the week, done some recovery runs in them, and, it, and it's great, you know, they, they just eat up the miles. There's, it sounds horrible to say there's nothing special about them, but I think that's a really good thing. The fact is that they're not like lighting you up and going, yeah, this is like the best thing ever. They're, they're, there's something about a very good shoe that's made with, with not much noise and, and put together well and does everything you'd expect from a running shoe and and i think that's what this is so maybe to say they're not special is a bit a bit harsh you're probably 361 to kill me but hopefully you know what i mean it's it, it's not something that will go out and grab you but actually if you're looking for a neutral running shoe that's going to give you plenty of cushioning plenty of responsiveness loads of breathability a really good outsole that you can get out there and run in, do the basics and run in and go distances or do your short little park, park runs or whatever you want to do, this is a great shoe. It is a great, great shoe. The only thing I would say, and obviously I'm lucky enough I didn't pay for them, they're, they're not cheap. They're, you know, This is 160 euros, I believe. Um, so it's not the cheapest thing in the world. But I think like with some of the Brooks out there, the A6, you know, the better shoes out there, you do have to pay that little bit more for. So. I think it's worth spending that money. 
I do think they are better than an A6 Nimbus 22. I know it's a bold statement, but I do believe that. For me, they fit better than the Brooks. Brooks, for me, pinching quite a bit round here, so I tend to get heat spots round here. Uh, but these don't. It's a nice wide uh, toe box for me. And yeah, I just, I just really dig putting miles in them, guys. I say something different as well, which I think goes a long way. You know, it's not your Brooks. It's not your, your A6. It's something different from the norm. I can't recommend it enough. Check them out. 361 Spire 4. I think you'll be impressed.